How's it going, everyone? My name is Cornship, and welcome back to Code of the Black Knights. If things sound weird, again, I have a new microphone, and I'm still playing around with the settings. Uh, really just the gain on my audio interface. And uh, I, I just hope it's coming through okay, because I'm going to keep tinkering with it until I find something I'm super happy with. Anyway, here we are. Noir's all by herself. Uh, someone in the comments said I could go ahead and use Avalon, so I guess using magic doesn't actually have any bearing on anything. So I will go ahead and do that. And other than that, I don't really know... Uh, I don't know if she's going to have everything to do... Going to have to do everything on her own? We'll find out. I'm just going to send her forward. We're going to switch her stuff around. Like, I'll get rid of the javelin because who cares? And then we will take back Avalon and... I guess lose for comment just in case. And uh, we'll go ahead and Avalon this person. And we will overkill this person. So I did wait until the uh, previous part came out. So I've got some comments in. And apparently I need to defeat the final boss in like three turns, which hopefully I can do. I'm not very optimistic. Also, I forgot to check the augury. Didn't it say something about this? Can I even do this? Sorry, I didn't read it as right, or the first line. Let's start as usual. The spirits need to be dealt with. But I can't get too close, even if they need time to charge. The dark power emanating from them is ridiculous. If they do charge, the result will be instant death. It seems a spirit is created instantly every minute. Is that every turn, then? And once the weapon awakens, every already existing orb creates a replica. If all the altars are active and charged, then... No, I got this. See, I don't know what it's talking about there. It's possible there aren't any of those orb things yet, but I don't know how to tell. I mean, there's only so many things I can do with Noir right now, such as move forward and attack, which is what I did, so we're just gonna... We're gonna see what happens. I think I talked about last time how I've got, like, both of my microphones plugged in, because my old microphone I had my headset through, um, and I talked about how I needed an adapter. That adapter came, so now... Old microphone is fully gone and unplugged. I just have new microphone, audio interface, and headset plugged into the audio interface, so... I'm moving up in the world. But I'm so stupid, I don't know how to actually do audio balancing, so... Again, this could sound really bad, I don't know. My main issue is like... And sorry, I'm just kind of rambling while enemy phase goes on, but... My main issue is, I don't know if it's better to have a small gain, and then boost the audio in my audio capture, and then like, in the video editing portion? Or if I turn the gain up really high on my audio interface now, and not have to do as much processing, I guess, later on. I don't know what's better for, like, the audio quality. The ritual has started, but damn it, I can't get closer. Okay, so the things on the left, or sorry, up, were just reinforcements, I'm sure. And then this is probably... Okay, this is a Doom Spirit. So this is the thing that has to charge, I guess? But I don't know how many turns it takes to charge. And also, I don't know when, if or when I'll get there. I'm a little scared to send Noir... Well... I want to keep Avalon out, because I believe it gives her a defense boost, but I also need to get her closer to my enemies, so... Hopefully putting her here isn't a mistake. Someone in the comments did say I get help. Which, I'm kind of expecting, because there's no way Noir could do this all on her own. As powerful as she is, without like a Gale Force or Refresh skill like Schwarz has, uh, it seems to be pretty impossible. And nobody to like warp her around or anything. I don't know why it's not letting me end the turn. Oh, because it still thinks I have these people. Hi, friends! <laughs> if only you were actually here. Oh no. Uh-oh. I made a mistake. <laughs> I made a, a big mistake. How do I fix this? Oh no. I should not have done that. I really should not have done that. Okay, okay, okay. We might be fine. Okay. That was stupid. Let's never do that again. Okay, hopefully, well, even if they have counter, it'd have to be a magic counter to, like, actually affect her. Maybe 
Maybe I should have given her a Junifruit. I can't remember if she's maxed or not in experience. I think she is not. <laughs> oh, cool. Thanks, dude. I don't want this. Yeah, I'm mostly worried about the people who have ranged attacks, because I obviously can't hurt them when I have Avalon on. Also, maybe I should have turned animations off, just because this is going to take a long time. I think we're just going to be sitting here watching animations for, like, minutes upon minutes. As cool as the animation is, don't get me wrong, it takes a long time. And I don't think that we need to see it 20 times. But at this rate, we're going to see it 20 plus times. Especially if she doesn't skill or crit. We're already going to have to watch it twice in this skeleton fight right here. I wish I had given her the Night Mantle. But I think that's on Say right now. Who is currently gone. All my friends are not dead, but preoccupied and or passed out. Like Schwarz. I think he passed out. Okay, I got the skill, so that should be a kill. Yeah, if I don't forget, I'm probably going to turn animations off, at least... At least until I get back up or something. Because right now, just having Noir... <laughs> doing this over and over. Not the most riveting thing to watch. Maybe if there was more enemy variety, but it's literally just Skeleton Man, Skeleton Man. More Skeleton Man. Noir, the least you could do is crit. Spare us from watching this twice. Here we go! Skeleton number 10! I actually don't know what number this is. At least we got the skill. I feel like there's more I should talk about when we're at endgame, but not there at the moment. Wait, what am I saying? No, we are at endgame. I just don't know what else to talk about. <laughs> okay, I really hope this doesn't hit us, because 16 damage would suck. And for some reason, that screen vibration made me think she was getting hit. But luckily, that is not the case. Here's another one. Even less of a chance to hit me, so don't. Okay, cool. I think I have some healing in the convoy, though. If at all necessary. Ooh, that's a good chance to hit me. And it didn't. What about this one, though? Another nose for Atu. She could have died right here if those both hit. That would have been annoying. I'm gonna have to use an elixir. Oh, shit. Um... Impossible. It's getting even darker. What the? The white weapon. It drains power from the soul. It's trapped at the tower. I don't know who's talking. Who's there? Your arrival here accelerated the weapon's awakening. Your soldier's life force gave life to these spirits. Your time is running out. Then what do I do? You do not stand a chance against the white weapon. Am I supposed to know who this is? Not by yourself, at least. Elias. The Prime Minister? Is that who that was? How are you still here? When my own weapon enslaved me, it bound me to its power. The only way you can harm it right now is by destroying the conduits. Once it manages to charge them all, however, it will unleash Ragnarok. We have only minutes before it does that. We can't even reach the spirits. Then I will create one for you. I am bound to this wretched creature I helped make. The least I could do is help you destroy it, lest Weissold meet Doom too. We must hurry, there is no time. Well, I don't think we can reach it right now. Oh, that's not true, but... What happens when I kill it, though? Like, I don't know if, uh... No, she can't even kill it unless she crits. So it's, it's a good crit chance, don't get me wrong. But Elias can't reach, so... I don't know if I want to risk that, because if she misses, she's probably going to die. Actually, let's check out Elias, I haven't even done that. The Prime Minister of Weisold, his pride caused a tragic downfall. He is a gold knight. Which I think is what, uh, 
Josephine is, right? Anyway, he has a rune sword and a master spear. Uh, his stats are like whatever. Let's check his skills. He gains two damage and takes minus two damage per 25% below max HP. He has Kanto. He has Provoke. I don't know if that'll apply when Noir can probably be killed though. So I don't know about that right now. Uh, he gets better when people attack him. And he gets more damage. Or wait, no, he gets more crit and takes less damage the more he moves. I'm scared of doing this because I feel like this is the play. I need to kill this thing. But if she doesn't crit or skill or anything, she's just going to be sitting there with 15 HP, and then I'll have to start over. But I did save state it, so whatever. Please crit. Alright, bad start. We need the skill and crit right now. Maybe not both, but absolutely one. How do I not get a 60% crit? Well, I think I lose. That's annoying. All right, Elias, I hope you can actually draw everybody with your Provoke, but I doubt it. So... I say let's get rid of a Nosferatu then, because they're what hurt the most? Oh, you get a 42 crit. Good for you. Too bad Noir couldn't do it. <laughs> well, let's see what happens. She might die. Oh, this one went after Elias. I hope he'll be okay. He's got a lot of HP, but... That doesn't necessarily mean... Much. I mean, as long as he survives this enemy phase, I can switch him to his rune sword and he can start healing. Yeah, that's what I was worried about. And of course he hits a 53. And of course Noir didn't get a crit. I don't get you, Noir. It's the end of the game, kind of. I need you to step it up. You've been amazing this entire game, and now you're suddenly not getting these insane crit chances. I don't get it. A level up would be nice, because it would maybe help your survivability at least a little bit. Dodging these weak attacks would also be great. There's a crit. I think she's gonna die. And then I will have to restart. I don't know from where. Oh, it's a brave weapon. I was like, I don't understand what the fiery fang does. I just figured it out, though. See, look at Elias popping off these crits that's even less of a chance than what Noir has. Nora's probably dead because those snakes are going to attack her. Because I don't think they can reach Elias. Sorry if I'm saying that name wrong. Anyway, I also forgot to check the animations like I said I would. I got distracted by my new unit. But it's whatever. I'm assuming this isn't the final boss that they're talking about, like, trying to destroy. Ooh, you actually have a decent hit chance. Too bad you're dead. My Master Spear is going to break so quickly. <laughs> nice dodge. Nice little tap right there. Oh, you're doing the doubling. I'm kind of surprised. I see the sword masters and I assume that they will double me. But no, not when you're the prime minister. Oh, okay, Elias was close enough. I'd say don't hit, but I don't really care because he's got a lot of HP. Wonder if that'll level him up. Sure did. I think he's maxed now. Okay, well, I wish you got more, but it's fine. Yeah, that's what I was worried about. If this hits, I lose. All right, we live in. Is this the last attack? I hope so. Goodbye, 
Naga demon thing. Thank you for the level. I don't know if it'll save Noir at this point. I mean, Res is good. Everything's in 20s now, at least. Oh, we're not done. There's still somebody down there. But they should all go after Elias, I hope. How is the Master Spear not destroyed yet, by the way? We've got to be close. Right? Dude, there's still so many enemies to get through. Why didn't I turn the animations off? Okay, nice crit. Is your Master Spear broken yet? I mean, I don't want it to be broken. But he's got to be close. Maybe it'll break on this last guy. Wouldn't that be poetic? Not justice. That's not really the right thing. It didn't break, though. Wow. Okay, anyway, um, please die. And hopefully something else happens now. Is this it? Did we do it? I don't know, Noir. I really don't. Ragnarok, it hasn't stopped! Destroying the conduit, it did nothing? No, it did everything. Oh, snap. What is happening? That's not the end of the game, right? Are we still in the tower? Indeed. My objective was to stop Calm from conquering the world. Defeat it at all costs, not to destroy it. That is why Leighton and I built this white weapon. A living weapon of godlike power. We gave it the power to think, to judge. We tried to play God. But we lacked the material. Speaking of Leighton, did I ever have to deal with him? With a single rune shard, it was possible. We lost control quickly. Ragnarok was never meant to be. Lumei's destruction was never meant to be. I let, left a fatal flaw in case something like this happened. If the weapon was forced to redirect massive amounts of power, then its flow of energy will destabilize, become vulnerable. You can see it too, can you not? The clear blue sky? I had wished to see it once more before the end. The darkness is left. Does that mean we're done? No, this is merely the beginning. Oh, shit, sure enough. We may have interrupted Ragnarok, but the weapon... It has begun to awaken. We must strike the final blow. Oh hey, I have friends! Chores! I'm glad I made it. As soon as the darkness was gone, I knew I had to do something. Let's go. What about the others? The situation got complicated, but the others are on their way. Everyone, the time to return peace to our land has finally come. Okay, so chapter 21X. I'm assuming this will be the final boss then? You, white weapon. A deadly beast in the bringer of Ragnarok seeks to kill God and sink the world on instinct. It's just acting on instinct. It didn't do anything wrong. Anyway, people were recommending I blast this with, like, meteors and stuff. I don't know if I have any siege tomes in my convoy, though, which is a problem. Uh, let's see. I mean, oh, that's not it. I have a blizzard, which I can use, obviously. That literally, oh, and then a shadow shot, and that literally might be it. I think that is it, unless someone's sitting on one in their inventory, which is also possible. I will flip through every single person. Um, I don't think so, though. Unless uh, Elizabeth has one. She has a purge tome. Okay. And you have a meteor as well. So I might be using Oliver for attacks rather than uh, healing. Anyway, let's pick my units. Actually, I'm going to go ahead and save state it because I always do it chapters. You guys know this. Uh, let's pick out the team. I have to bring Elias, which not sure how I feel about that. Um, I don't want to bring Mia, I don't really know. Or Aunt Sabaru, don't know why they're deployed. I definitely would like Angel. I would like Grey. I would like Lowell, but who would I get rid of? Can anybody besides Elizabeth use a Purge Tome? Although if she crits with it, it'll be nice, but... 
I could leave out Josephine. I really like her, but I don't know how much she's needed. What if I do leave her out? I need to give that Hoplin shield to somebody. But if I leave her out to bring Lowell in, and then is there anybody else sitting out that I want? I really don't like leaving Josephine out, but I have to bring Elias, so he's kind of a better Josephine. I don't know if that's true, but I'm going to say it. Okay, so I don't think she needs these, or at least let's get rid of the Silver Axe. I think she could take the Shadow Shot. Um, say, do you have any? No, you have the Night Mantle. Uh, I need to give... Where the hell is she? I need to give Josephine's Hoplin Shield to someone. I don't know if it's necessary on Elias. I will get, go ahead and give him this, though. And then maybe this. I don't know if there are any mages coming, but... Okay, so who else needs a Hoplin Shield? I could give it to Noir. I don't think she needs to hold the Fire Emblem anymore. Unless it, like, boosts her stats or something. I can't remember. Is that from the Fire Emblem? Or is it from Avalon? Hmm. Well, if I'm using Oliver to, like, nuke, he should probably hold on to the Night Mantle. Uh... I also need to give Oliver... Sorry, I'm, I hope I don't take too long on this, but this is, like, the final chapter, I think. Uh, I might as well be prepared. Speaking of being prepared, let's uh, check the formation and see what we can do. Noir and Elias can't be moved. But... You guys can. I don't know if I want Hermes here, but I wouldn't know where else to put him. You guys are fine together. Say and Gray? Kind of weird? I could bring Gray with Oliver to help boost him up. Oh shit, I forgot about the stupid visual glitch. I don't mind having Angel here with Shores and Oliver because they can go... Who's Hermes support? He doesn't have an A support anymore. Just a lot of Bs. The only one that could potentially be with him is Hazel. I don't know if I want to do that. I kind of need carry units in these places because... I'm gonna have to take care of these, uh, well this isn't one, but are there Doom Spirits around? Is that what they were called? So far there aren't any, but if they're gonna spawn here I need to be careful. Also I might not have to worry about it though, because if I just kill him in three turns then it's GG. Right? <laughs> like Mithra probably shouldn't be in one of these places, but who the heck would I switch her out with? Also moving her all the way there is gonna be a pain. Probably switch with Gray. Sorry, Gray. <laughs> I don't think Mithra is gonna do well, like on her own. So Gray and Hazel, kind of a weird combination. Elizabeth in zeros, fine, but like, I'd prefer to have Elizabeth hitting this guy, and I don't think that's doable. <sighs> I don't know. I'm worried about the different sides here because I don't know if everybody can take on everything. But I don't really know what else to do. Anyway, back to the items. I need to give Elias some more stuff, probably. Rune Sword, he already has one. Master Sword? That's not bad. Actually, no, 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 no. Levin Sword. I think Noir's pretty good. Schwarz is fine. Oliver's got his important stuff. Zero's got his stuff. You... Probably fine. Hazel's fine. You're fine, say... Uh... You don't need a Flux. Uh... Good against casters? Sure. Can take out some of those... Necromancers or whatever that I saw. Okay, well, I think I'm as ready as I'll ever be. I'm gonna save it again just because I did all that inventory crap. 
And let's hope this isn't a huge failure. Listen, I want to thank you all for coming here. We need to take out those spirits. If they are charged, all we fought for will be in vain. I didn't click anything. You heard her destroy the conduits at all costs. Hmm, I guess all streaks of bad luck end someday. The fate of the world is in our hands now. We must not lose. One more, then we can go home. You are an abomination. In the name of God, be gone! Target located. Commencing mission. May the light guide us, as it always has. You, you are a corruption of everything I represent. You have no right to live. We have all made sacrifices to make it this far. We are not allowed to lose. Well, I also just don't want to lose, so... Our hearts and souls sing in unison. Okay, Angel. In the name of Zoila, I will fulfill my duty and return victorious. I've come too far to let a puny god defeat me. In the name of my mother, you will see what I'm capable of. This is our only chance. Do not disappoint me, knights. Victory here will require success on all fronts. Everyone, prepare yourselves. But we're not done. We have wasted enough time with words. Black knights, charge! Uh, Conduit Spirits will now drop Light Shards on defeat, boosting all stats. Collect four Light Shards and have their holders stop in stair tiles to unleash a devastating finisher. Well, I don't know if I have time for that, because I need to kill this guy in three turns? I wonder if I'll just keep restarting my game. I'm assuming everybody's cool with that, if I just keep restarting. <laughs> if I, uh, fail to kill the boss in three turns. Let's see what this even looks like. I don't think I can reach him from here. I need to move... Like, right next to the dragon. Or further down. Okay, well that's terrible. So... Looks like Noir might not be the, the answer here. Who else was there? Oliver? I'm a little worried after seeing Noir's performance. Or lack thereof. Oh god, I clicked the wrong way. We're gonna cycle through, like, everybody. Also very bad. Is the blizzard any better? Let's cycle this way this time. Oh, Blizzard has a better range. Okay, everybody's saying, oh, they're really good. Like, the boss is... Like, you can purge him and whatnot. How? Nobody can hit him. He gets... I already looked at him. He gets, like, better stuff when we initiate. <sighs> I don't know. Uh, if I can get Shores up there, maybe he can do a good job fighting. I don't know. Let's get started. Actually, hold on a second. Do you have counter? I think you do. I figured a warrior like you would have that. Disgusting. This kind of sucks, though, because what else am I going to do? Wait, I don't need to get in your face. We can just do this. Okay, yeah, I don't know how this is gonna go. We'll see. I'm not optimistic I can kill this guy in three turns or whatever. That seems pretty, uh... Difficult. That was good Aether, though. If all the battles are like that, I'll be fine. Although, of course, he didn't activate his refresh thing. You know, let's go over here, and what do you have? Master Axe versus Master Sword? I prefer you go after the... Sword. Uh, and I guess we'll have to Brave Lance it. Oh wait, you have a sword as well. Maybe you could do this, actually. Although, I'm gonna have to double-check once again. You do not have a counter. And you don't either. Cool. If I White Rose this guy, he dies. Oh, and we level up. Cool. Love that for me. And it was a decent last level, I think. Was that your last? Yeah. Don't know what this guy has and why he has an exclamation point. Oh, because it's a killer. That's why. Uh, hopefully we'll be fine. I might have to go sword here, because if he's going to go axe against me... It's not great. I think we crit, though. No, we didn't. I lied. But we killed. That's all that matters. 
Paragon does not level me. Is there anything up here? Oh, just this guy who I almost got in range of. Kind of glad I didn't. Okay, this is the side I'm worried about, because I don't feel like they are going to do very well. I mean, I'd love to be wrong. If you can hit these Braves, then I don't have to worry. I kind of doubt Say can kill. Oh, wait, Retribution. Just kidding. Die. I am a little worried for uh, this guy attacking her afterwards, especially with the Brave Lance. Do I risk the killer or the brave? What is her defense? Ooh, he's a little scary. I can't even brave axe kill him. Huh. Is Hermes bad or am I just, is that guy just really powerful? Oh, uh, he can't kill any of these people. I think they might what do I do? If that Doom Spirit comes up, I'm kind of in trouble. I don't really know what Mithra can do. She could attack this guy, but that could leave her in trouble. Also, there's no guarantee it would even do that well. Oh! I lied. That's not bad. I might use Oliver as well, because his little nuke didn't do very well. Maybe when he's next to Shores, it'll be better. I kind of doubt it, but let's see. It is not better. Not better at all. Do I just have really bad units? Because what were you people on with, like, saying I could just nuke the boss? Should it be on Noir? Noir's Shadow Shot didn't really do a good job, though. So I don't know. Anyway, I guess I will go ahead and risk Mithra. That sounds really dumb now that I'm saying it out loud. Maybe she'll get a 5% crit. That'd be pretty dope. She didn't. But she could have, and it would have been really cool. I think I'll just have him... <sighs> Scythax. You need like everything, and you didn't really get everything. <laughs> oh, you have Gale Force. Why do I always forget about that? I'm just not used to you having it. That still doesn't really help me, though, because it's not like you can kill this guy. And in fact, attacking is kind of risky. Uh, not really, unless they got the 23 crit, which... There's a good chance of it. But I could also crit, and that would help me win. Or it's skill. What skills do you have? Let's find out. doesn't really help me. Still don't know what I'm gonna do with Oliver. I mean, even though maybe I should be saving these nukes for the boss, since he can't really hit anyway, I might as well just... I could do that. That would help Hermes out. That might be the best. Did I crit? I might have crit. I definitely crit. boy, Oliver. Now Hermes can go after that mage, maybe. Could also be dangerous. Brave Axe, though? Does pretty well, but can you hit harder with anything else? No. 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 Alright, Brave Axe it is. Please don't miss a 92. Or I will cry. Thank you. Okay, well, aside from reinforcements, that side's actually done. Who would have thought? Let's blaze knife our husband. That's code for something the kids can't hear. Okay, she got replenished. That's nice. I still don't know what I'm going to do about this guy, because that counter really, really sucks. And I already used both my healers, so I can't exactly... Uh, You don't have any magic proficiency either. Dang. But like, does... Hmm. I might have magic swords. 
Or, I don't think those magic axes. I could use the goddess axe? Wow. Uh, does Seiken count as... magic? Windblade would count as magic, right? Indirect wind attacks, but what if that's not strong enough? Let's find out. It is not strong enough, unless I crit or skill. Let's go to the drawing board again. <laughs> also, what if these don't count as magic anyway and I just hurt myself still? For no reason. I mean, if I do hurt myself, I at least heal, but this still isn't killing. Were there any other magics? I didn't look at the Seiken, but I don't know if that'll count. Plus, I think at this point it's pretty underpowered. Where is it? Huh. It's not bad. But it might count as not magic. And then that would suck. You know, I'm just gonna play it safe-ish. Whoops. Sorry I'm taking so long. I'm gonna play it safe ish, as I said, and go for the rune sword. It won't kill unless he crits or skills, but if it is taking damage, he'll at least heal up. Okay, he did not take damage from it. Please, crit or skill? Please? Damn it. I do have Angel, though. Or he'll, he might refresh, too. I kind of stressed for, like, no reason there. He did not refresh. He's awful. <laughs> it's a little harsh. Mithra and Oliver are still screwed, though, at this rate. Unless Shores have Provoke or something, but I don't think he does. I really hope you'll get another boost. Damn it. I really need your guys' refreshes! Oliver and Mithra are probably in pretty big trouble here. I don't know if this is worth the Reflect damage. Yeah, I shouldn't. Oh, a little late for that, asshole. <laughs> Guys, I really don't see myself killing this- Ooh, Killing this boss in three... turns. There's no way. Also, why... Wait, I think you do better with the Nell when you're up close. Yep, absolutely. Okay, I'm feeling a little better for Oliver and Mithra now, but not much. Ow. Rude. Ooh, I'll heal it up, maybe. Am I full health? Am I at full health? I am, but I did not refresh, so Oliver or Mithra can get slapped by a Brave Lance. That sucks. Um, I might have gotten in the range of- I sure did. That's not good either. Oops. Okay, well, you know, let's- let's go to these two. Hmm. There is a beefy boy here that can't be crit, can't be doubled, so I don't know how that's gonna go for us. Hmm. Dragonstone, I think, did the best, but... Whatever. Uh, 1224, 3648, sure. Oh, or you'll crit. That's fine, too. I guess we'll just let him do what he wants, the big boy, because I think... Oh, but I can't kill you, either. Bummer. Okay, I guess we'll let the Windblade do what they want, and hit this guy for good damage. And then, hopefully they wrap things up on the enemy phase. Well, they won't with the Wind Sword guy, because he can stay out of our range. Yeah. Alright, I don't really know how I feel about Elizabeth on this end. It'd be great if any of them had a Gale Force, but they definitely don't. Can you kill any of them? Let's just... Ooh! Yeah, you can! <sighs> Brave Axe or Master Axe or... Great Bow that has a bunch of skills that boost how well you do. I think I can at least see the preview. So this guy attacked me. It's not so bad with him receiving the attack, but... 
he gets better in the enemy phase. I don't know, man. I don't know what to do. I really wish one of you guys had Gale Force. Also, there's a dude down here. Oh. Okay. Well. I think my safest play is getting rid of a Master Axe. I'm sorry, I feel like this first turn is taking forever and I'm all over the place. I have no faith in myself defeating this boss in three turns. Not a bad last level. Or is that your last level, actually? Yes. Silver bow, this guy dead? The great bow will attack one of us. Um, did I do all the sides yet? It's just Noir and Elias, I believe. Yep. Okay. I don't know what to do here. I say that a lot, but it's just because it's true and I don't know what to do. Like, taking 38 damage would suck horribly. So does magic work better against you? Is that it? What works better against you? Oh, I don't know. How do we kill this thing? Whoops. Oh, Lucifer Comet, but then you're gonna be hurting quite a lot. And I don't know if I can rescue you, but hey, I committed this anyway. Maybe I'll crit and I don't have to worry about it. I did! Thank God. Get out of here, dragon. Bye-bye. Okay, that's one less thing to worry about. And Elias can't do anything for me at the moment. He has Provoke. I really can't do much against this guy either. Your Master Spear is almost broken. <laughs> uh, let's go with this Master Spear and then he'll switch to Rune Spear once it breaks. Or Rune Sword, sorry. Oh, nice dodge. Okay, one less thing, uh... Hazel and Zero have to worry about. Now let's see what happens. A Master Spear, and I'm gonna break mine. Oh, and I killed him. That's convenient. Oh wait, the Master Spear's not broken yet. Oh, are you gonna counter me? That's not good for me. Oh, I Aethered though. I'll at least heal before I take damage, right? <laughs> don't counter me, don't do it. Nice. Although it could be visually glitching. I'll never know. Oh, looks like he's fine. I think they double me because his Master Sword? Yeah. Maybe I'll Aether? Heal up that little, uh, nice. Sure, it's just Aether everything and I will feel a little bit better about my chances here. I'm gonna assume he healed. And it's just that visual stuff going on. Yeah, he did. And what, was I expecting this? Are we good? I think we're good. She's gonna crit because 109. <laughs> Is that it for their end? I don't remember. There's just the mage. Okay. That doesn't move. Um, cool with this. I should break the Master Spear now? Yeah, and then now we're on Rune Sword. Okay. Cool with me. Even though I got Savage Blowed, and that's pretty annoying. Yeah, I'll take your damage and heal it. I don't care. Or I'll miss a 90. That's cool, too. There we go. Back in the question mark range, although I just got Savage Blowed. <laughs> that's what I was worried about. Oh, no. If those both hit... Okay, he's good. For now. Oh, God. Oh, God. I'm scared. So scared. I'm sorry, Oliver. I risked your life. Savage Blow? Hopefully nothing else can reach him. That's annoying. Also, I think the dragon, the boss, can go after Shores, so... We'll see what happens with that. Oh, his skill didn't really get much better with 
him initiating the combat. Not complaining. If only Shores had a range of three. Oh, I need you to heal Oliver, though. Well, that's unfortunate. What is this? Oh, well, shit. I don't have a restore up there. That's annoying. Oh, this is also annoying. No, stop. Stop it. What are you doing? This isn't fair. For real? Stop. Also, did you not attack Shores? You little baby? Oh, and there are reinforcements everywhere? Oh, I hate this. This is not fun. I understand it's endgame, but that is not fun at all. Okay, well, Hazel doesn't have to worry about the Doom Spirit yet. You guys do. <laughs> this doesn't even kill. What about the Giant's Feller? Giant's Feller kills. I need this thing dead, so... Because the game really lays it on that this should die. And I will listen to the game. I guess I'll put away the silver bow. I kind of want to keep the Genji gloves on. Oh, you guys won't be safe. But if I move her in range... Hmm. I mean, she's going to get hurt again, but I have to put her here. Actually, I probably could have put her in range of the mage and it would have been fine, but now it's too late. Did I see if her purge did anything? I think she had a horrible hit chance. Maybe not when she's next to zero, but I will never find out. <laughs> All right, so what the fuck do I do? I don't really like the idea of risking Noir again up in this dragon's face, but like, I do need to kill the dragons. Hazel doesn't have to worry about anything and we need to protect Gray as best as we can. Whoops. I don't like Luna's, and the Eclipse also sounds annoying, so... Oh, the Eclipse doesn't have a very good chance to hit her, though. So that's nice. So I killed one Doom Spirit. Didn't another one spawn somewhere? Right there? Is there one over here? No. Okay, well, Rose and Lowell should have this wrapped up, I think. I mean, he just spawned, so I'm not super worried. Oh wait, Sidilith Axe. Oh, darn. He can't double with it. Alternatively, can you kill with your crit chance? Possibly? I think I'll try this, but I'll let's move Lowell in first. He can kill this one. I don't know if I've seen him use an axe. That was pretty cool, I guess. <laughs> Aw, oh, sick. Magic. Love that. Alright, so... Should be able to slaughter this one, I hope. I'm assuming my crit is 128 and not actually 28. Hopefully you like Astra or something, though? Actually, if they both crit, I think it's a kill. Yeah, 128. Cool. Because that should be 45, and then the next one will be 45. So you should be dead. Thank you, Lowell, for the crit boost. Appreciate ya. That's two light shards. Oh. I don't think I've used the light brand like at all. Let's put it away. Shores kind of needs healing. Oliver needs healing. I don't really have heals to give. Uh, let's see here. They can't move very far, so I say we maybe just kill this. Oh, this is one of the things. Yeah, absolutely, let's just kill this. More like overkill this. Uh 
I know Fenrir is powerful, but I only have four left, so let's just put it away. Hmm, if you were to go down there, this guy has a battle axe. Can you kill this thing, though? Yes. Let's do it. Five percent crit, nice. Didn't matter. Oh yeah, why do I always forget about this Gale Force? Um, I don't know if I want to do this though. Scythax looking kinda not well, this would kill, right? Assuming I don't miss. I can only miss once. Let's try it. So far so good. Hopefully I dodge, but if not, whatever. Ow. Alright. Hermes Gale Force, very nice. Okay. Do you have a restore on you? I put it away, didn't I? No, I didn't. So I could waste one of his turns to restore. I mean, is it really a waste? I don't know. Kind of, probably. Not the best level. But whatever. You need to heal him. I'm already at 50 minutes. I don't know if I should end it or just keep going. Really do not know. I need to save my friends over here, though. So if I could Rune Sword kill and I can't. Or what about if I get, like, up close personal? Doesn't really get any better, I don't think. Nah, we'll see what happens here. Aether? Damn. I might take a whole lot of damage right here. Okay, there's an Aether. I don't know if it'll be enough healing, though. Oh, it's actually pretty good. He didn't get his refresh. Uh, Oliver and Mithra are still in range of, like, probably everything. A lot of things. Maybe Oliver and Mithra down here wasn't the play, but... I don't know. It's not like I can go back. No refresh, that's a bummer. Uh... Rune Sword? They'd probably be fine against that. I'm probably more worried about these bows more than anything else. So let's get rid of one of the bows. Oh, I can't kill it with the frickin'... Rune Sword, that's the name. What if the Nell had healing properties? That'd be pretty dope. But it doesn't, so who cares? Okay, I'm getting closer and closer to the white weapon, which worries me a little bit, because I don't know how Shores will do against it. Eh, he doesn't take a lot of damage, although I think it has more than one, uh, weapon to use against me. So, we'll see. <sighs> Part of me wants to kill this guy, because I think he has a silence, and that's pretty annoying. But whatever, I will kill this other archer so my healers are safe. I will heal up my little bit of health missing. I will absolutely overkill this guy, actually. <laughs> Just fully decimated. No refresh. Kind of a bummer. Uh, we finished the left. Finished all of bottom. Uh, we finished this because Gray can't do shit. So now it's just Noir and Elias and what I want to do with them. And the answer is I have no idea. Technically, Noir should be pretty safe as long as Elias is nearby. So I could theoretically have her go Lucifer Comet this. Oh, I wish she could do enough damage to kill without risking that 31, but I think I have to risk it. Because I need Dragon Dead. Crit, crit, crit. Nope, that's a bummer. Maybe we'll dodge, but probably not. Oh, I didn't dodge it, and now I got the 
skill. Very good. Love that for me. And Elias, I don't think we're in good shape here. But at least you can kill and heal up. Hopefully you will provoke things, but I'm not optimistic because you're not that close to Noir. We'll see. Like I just said, I'm... Yeah, exactly. I'm not optimistic at all. At least we dodged. And crit. Man, so much for this provoking plan. <laughs> Can you dodge, please? Well, maybe I'll end the video when Noir dies and I have to start over. And then I can get more tips from you guys, because I need them. <laughs> if I'm trying to really do this in three turns. Ten HP, will she survive? Probably not. Oh, that's annoying. Yeah, I don't know how to know when you're actually doing damage and when you're not. Because the visual stuff really likes to throw me for a loop. Hopefully I Aether and heal up whatever you did, but nope. I do not. Yeah, I think she's gonna die. No, she's absolutely dead. For sure. Yep. Alright, I get to start over now. <laughs> Wait. Are we too late? Has the end already begun? Hang on, Noir. I will pro... And then Noir dies. Schwarz? Schwarz! Oh, is Schwarz the one who dies? Siegfried, I'm sorry. Oh, everybody's dying. You have nowhere to return now, do you? Oh, everybody just be dying. Okay. We've changed fate, and the future is so dark. What have we done? Help us. Help! Oh, cool, we get to see the bad end. <laughs> it appears this era will be my grave. Adrian, forgive me. I needed more time. Sorry, Zero. Has God forsaken us? What were we fighting for? My luck ran out? No, the mission. I'm not done. Light has perished. All is lost. Oh, no. The darkness. It spirals out of control. The world is losing its balance. I, I can't believe this. I should have been more careful. My fallen friends. I can see them. I'm a little upset for whatever Lowell's gonna say. I wonder what would happen when all the laughter is gone. I guess we'll find out quite soon. I have failed. Death is the only outcome left for me. What about your brother, though? Be more sad. Of course. There is no f there is no a failure like me can defeat a god. I'm assuming no way. This is only logical. Okay, I kind of thought he talked about his mom, so whatever. He was just very self-deprecating and hard on himself. We had one chance and we blew it. Oh, what is happening? Huh. <laughs> She's laughing. My fault. My... Worst ending. Final despair. Sweet! I got to see the worst ending. <laughs> Does anything else happen? Hello? Please don't, like, jump scare me or something. I'm a baby. You were right. You nailed the correct answer. Like the Arcana Horde, the weapon feeds on sorrow. You finally broke. I suppose you believe that the continent will be destroyed now. Make no mistake, Naga will die. But I suppose I should thank you for weakening the weapon. Just enough for me to assume full control. 
And now, the new god will do as I command. I have won. Is Layton the true enemy? And I could never have done it without you. I suppose I should be thankful, Noir, but I hate you. You've stolen much of my power, and now, I do not have enough power to feed the white weapon, so that it regains its full strength. So, I have a new use for you. One of th those choices you humans like so much, but I don't like choices. Would you join me? Sacrifice yourself to feed the weapon? Uh, no. I believe I did not hear you correctly. Oh, I don't have a choice. I did believe I did not hear your true answer. Oh, Jesus Christ. Huh. Let's choose the bottom one off the screen. Good. But your allegiance is not enough. Even though all your friends have perished, you are still unable to feed the weapon. So, I will have to kill you again until your sorrow is enough. Oh, hi, friends that are just going to die over and over. Did you truly believe this is the first time you die here? I have kept and will keep killing you. Over and over again. And every time you die, your sorrow, your anger, your despair, your power will grow in intensity. Power. I think I said that kind of weird. <laughs> one day, you will become strong enough to fuse with the white weapon. The one destined to destroy God. And you both will take his place. Only then will you find purpose in your life. This is your fate. You cannot escape fate, Noir Rembrandt. You cannot escape me, I think is what it said. Well, you know... I'm kind of uh, glad I got that ending, because that's definitely more plot I wasn't aware of. Which was, the, I guess, Layton's the true evil, maybe? <laughs> uh, I don't know. Please give me some tips or something. I I don't know, man. I don't know how I'm going to kill that dragon in three turns, but uh, any any tips or whatever is appreciated. My convoy doesn't have much, though, as, in terms of like perch weapons, I don't think. So I don't know. I don't know what to do. Maybe I should leave Mithra and just Mithra out, but I need the restores, so I, I really don't know. I'll figure it out, hopefully. Again, but leave me any suggestions and whatnot, too. I appreciate it. So uh, thank you guys so very much for watching. If you made it this far, I'm assuming you enjoyed the episode, so consider leaving a like and subscribing to join the Small Crit Club, and I will see you all next time. Bye!